Once again, the bottom line is the swing plane described by the shaft of the club. Uh, the top line is the swing plane of the shoulders. Uh, what's going to happen is the club will come back nicely on the swing plane. See that? Hands are right on the swing plane. The shoulders need to be turning a little steeper, you can see that. But when he gets to the top, notice how his arm ends up almost perfectly on that upper swing plane, and the right elbow is on the lower swing plane, and the triangle that the arms create are, is intact. That's a great position right there. If he can simply reroute the club, the hands this way, reroute the hands back down, he's going to have a great swing. So let's see what he does. Oh, they didn't come down, did they? What they did is they stayed on the upper green line. And he ended up getting the, the club well out past the hands and he returned the hands to the ball from outside the swing line. So his back plane was great, but his down plane was over the top. And that's all caused right here on the transition. That's a good move there. There's the out over the top transition. You've got to feel yourself pulling the club down like that, which is the back swing. Perfect. Do that on the downswing and you won't be over the top. 